Welcome to the Kindergarten Center's graduation. Okay. Can I ask everyone to please take their seats? Thank you. Can everyone please take their seats? Thank you. Good morning. Take a good look on stage and what do you see? I see a world full of children who had the best school year ever. children's laughter, bright smiles, and kindness have turned the kindergarten center into its own small world. Our small world could not have happened this year without the support of everyone in this audience. Thank you. It has been a journey we were all part of. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for your encouragement every day. Please stand and join us for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States. The Lynnbrook Owl is a wise old scholar. If you're in kindergarten, stand up and holler. Woo! <laughs> this morning, the members of the Board of Education and Central Administration have come to watch this beautiful graduation. The support given by the Board of Education and Central Administration is greatly appreciated by the staff, parents, and children. At this time, I would welcome the board members who are here today, Mrs. Marcus, Mrs. Belmont, and Mrs. Hansen. I would also like to welcome Dr. Bjork, Dr. Lynch, Dr. Barakas, and Dr. Brennan. Please welcome Dr. Bjork, our superintendent of schools, as she shares a few words with our rainbow of graduates. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. How are you, graduates? Are you happy to be here? Yeah. We are very happy that you are here. Parents, families, we're so thrilled that at the beginning of this year, we know you began with such trepidation as what the year was going to bring. I hope you see the fruits of the labor of everyone, your partnership with us. As Mrs. Postman said, it takes a village. You were a great support for us. Thank you so much. As always, the Kindergarten Center is a beautiful place to begin one's educational career here in Limbrook. You see it before in front of you. We're so proud. We're so proud of all of you graduates. Thank you, families. This is just the beginning of a long journey that we hope will continue to bring good, happy moments for you to cherish forever. Congratulations.
in September, a new group of children began their kindergarten career along with three wonderful parent club liaisons, Mrs. Rivero, Mrs. Hakeem, and Mrs. Callenthorff. Let's give them a round of applause. I knew at that moment my year at the kindergarten center was going to be successful. At this time, I would like to thank the parents club for all of their support, dedication, and hard work. We became very close this year during our morning texting sessions, figuring out logistics on fundraising, yearbook collaboration, graduation planning, and so, so many other parent club matters. At this time, I will be speaking on behalf of the parents club. They are in the audience right now, so can I have my three liaison stand? <laughs> Our liaisons would like to thank the Board of Education for their support of the Kindergarten Center and their Parents Club. They would like to give a heartfelt thank you to the exceptional teachers and staff. Our children came to the KC each day, either in person or virtually, and were met with love, support, and encouragement. When you have a child who's about to enter kindergarten, the kindergarten center, you'll often hear that the KC is a magical place, almost too good to be true. The school and its staff is truly fabulous, and the children are beyond lucky to begin their education here. Many parents were nervous to send their kids to school for the first time this year, and that they would not have the same experience as previous kindergartners. But the teachers and staff went up beyond and above and never missed a beat. Despite a lot of challenges, our parents' club re-envisioned the KC traditions, such as pumpkin patch, picture day, holiday parties filled with arts and crafts projects, virtual assemblies, and a magic-filled family fun night for all to enjoy. Thank you to Mrs. Artusa, our school nurse. Your warmth was just the right medicine to make our kids feel better. Many thanks to our bus drivers and monitors this year, and a special thanks to our custodians. Lou, Henry, and Ralph, we could not have done it without you. <laughs> Thank you to Mrs. Robertino, our parent club treasurer, who managed our finances, and also to our class parents, committee chairs, and volunteers for helping the year run smoothly. And of course, a big thanks to our generous parents. The Parents Club would not be as successful without you and your support. To Mrs. Michelini, thank you <laughs> for all your invaluable assistance in the main office and for answering the phone every day. <laughs> you were patient with us and you never ended requests. You always gave updated information, updated class lists, hundreds of emails and phone calls, and always answered our questions swiftly. Finally, the most important, they would like to thank me, <laughs> Mrs. Postman. And they even highlighted it. <laughs> They truly appreciate my dedication, enthusiasm, and love for our children, and my complete support of the Parents Club while navigating the uncharted territory of a pandemic. <laughs> they are so thankful and knew from the beginning that everyone was in the best hands with me this year. None of what we accomplished this year would have happened without all of us working together. Thanks for letting us be as creative and technically innovations as we could be. It has been a pleasure working together. 
Congratulations to all of our graduates. We wish you all the good luck at your home schools, and we cannot wait to see you all together again at Limbrook High School in 2033. It's a long time from now. <laughs> And I just want to give a heartfelt thank you to everyone. The children work really hard to learn a poem that describes everything their teachers taught them in kindergarten. Sit back and listen to our young poets at work. Your seats, please. Thank you. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, with great pride and a lot of love, I now give you Limbrook High School's class of 2033. <laughs>
Over the past school year, so much has happened in our world. Each morning, I would wake up thinking about the love, respect, and commitment my staff has shown this year. I want to personally thank you, each and every one of you, for giving your heart and soul to your job. I could not have done this without you. I love you. Now our graduates would like to share their small worlds with you. I would like to thank Ms. Serpa and Mrs. W for everything they did in recording our songs this year. It's a little different than in the past, but we did it. I would also like to thank Frank for helping us with all the technical sound upstairs in the box. At this, small, at this moment, our small world will be lining up by class. You'll be able to see everyone smile in a few moments. Please remain in your seats until all the students have lined up on the blacktop at the end and one adult can go check their child out for the day. At this time, I'd like to introduce our small world, Mrs. Fitzsimmons Red Class.
Florida's Blue Class.